Meta Hall. Hello everybody, my name is Mr. Fox and welcome to Final Fantasy XIV. Uh, we are celebrating the Little Ladies Day event. And my son is screaming in the background. Uh, the Little Ladies Day event is a Japanese holiday uh, where little girls receive dolls and such things. And it celebrates the springtime and other cool stuff. So that's what we're going to do. Aligning the stars. A reporter from the Mithril Eye is eager to hear your opinion. This quest is real for only a limited time. Excuse me, sir. Sir, I'm a reporter from the Mithril Eye. I'm investigating adventures such as yourself for an exclusive feature on the Little Ladies' Day. Might I borrow a moment of your time to ask a few questions? Fantastic. I didn't say yes. Fantastic. As you may have heard, the Songbirds, a trio of talented preteen troubadours, are heading, are head, headling, headling, headling? Is that a word? This year's festival. Tell me, what do you think of them? I haven't seen that shit. You've never heard of the Songbirds? Well, you wouldn't be the first. The girls have been heard hard. Jesus Christ, I cannot read. Well, you wouldn't be the first. While the girls have been hard at work trying to liven up the festivities, it would seem that their efforts have gone largely unnoticed. Ever since the esteemed feminine retired, no star of noteworthy ability has come to grace the stage of Ulda. We at the Mithra Eye have been following their story in hopes of the songbirds would be able to fill that void she left behind. Were they to catch fire, it would serve to bolster the city-state's economy, but as it stands, they are still relative unknowns. This is the extent of my knowledge, but if you're interested in learning more, I'm sure the royal sentinel would be happy to oblige. Seeing that he's in charge of organizing the festivities, would you be able to find him at the Ruby Road Exchange? You should be able to find him at the Ruby Road Exchange. Blaine, please stop screaming. I'm trying to record here. Trying to record, yes. One thing I really love about the holiday, so... Um, I really love Japanese culture as a whole. Uh, and cherry blossoms are just kind of a symbol of the springtime in Japan. Um, and I really love... I love this... Um, this this uh, in-game event because uh, it is got some really cool colors and all the cool decorations is what I mean. Uh, the Royal Senchal, since since an whatever the f I need to expand my vocabulary. I am an idiot. Look at that guy. He's like, haha. Oh yes, that's correct. I am the central of the royal house of Ul, and I'm tasked with overseeing this year's Little Ladies Day festivities. How may I be of assistance? This guy told me about these songbirds. You're here to learn more about this year's main event, the songbirds. Yes, of course. Meh. You'll be performing. They'll be performing on the Emerald Avenue, and I presume you'll be coming. In fact, just. To be absolutely certain, allow me to present you with one of these fly. Oh, what the hell? Why, if it's the songbirds, the delicious preteen. Oh wait. Uh, excellent timing, girls. This adventure was just inquiring after you, but seeing as you're all here, why don't you introduce yourselves? Good to meet you. I am Ula La La. Ooh la la la. <laughs> soon to be one of Azoria's premier songsters, and you, sir, are soon to be my biggest fan. Good afternoon, my lord. I am a Narumi. We have practiced day and night for this opportunity, and would be honored if you were to attend our next performance. I am Masha. M Masha Maharakaraka. You can call me Masha. My. <laughs> My tongue may not be as sweet as Olala's, but I lack. But what I lack in charm, I make up for my dance. 
Masha, what exactly is that supposed to mean? Unlike some people, I am trying to gain recognition for our group. To do so, it's important to pour on a bit of charm. And you are without will. I am more than enough of the both of us. Oh, they are arguing. That is sad and not good. Is that so? Why did you number I me ahead of twice as many flies? You. I really like those outfits. I think those are the outfits you can actually get for the event, which is actually pretty cool. Means I'm gonna have to do this twice for my other character that I don't really play. Uh, enough with the instant prattling. Need to remind you, this type of behavior is a quick way to lose potential fans. Yes, please take a moment to go and compose yourselves. Who's that guy in the background? Oh, that's the weather guy, I think. My apologies, sir. With the constant one, with them constantly at one another's throats, it can be rather difficult to get things done. Sadly, however, that is not our biggest problem at present. You see, there are a few who are aware of the songbird's existence, and fewer still who will attend the performances. Time is running out, and we are nowhere closer to gaining recognition from the good people of Uda than when we first began. Adventure. What would you say to lending a hand in making the three young girls' dreams come true? I can't help but feel it must be fate that brought you to us, just as we were about to lose all hope. Eh, I guess I'll do it. What's it to those mustaches? Look at those mustaches. Are they all... I think that guy's wearing the fake mustache. You will? This is wonderful news. Please speak to one of my staff and they will set you straight to work. Daddy. Hi, Blaine. Open our go -Gurts. Okay, I'll open the go -Gurts. Okay, so we're going to talk to the guy with the fake mustache. Sugar spice and everything rice. What the shit? Sugar spice and everything rice. This is the royal, the royal servant asks you to help circulate flyers. Certificate of Collaboration. Wait, that's the rewards for a small square slip of parchment stamped with the Uldan Royal Satchel Seal. Proving your aid in the promotion of blah blah blah. Alright, I guess I'll accept it. You are one of the adventurers that is kind enough to offer assistance in promoting our trio of talented singers. Delighted to have you with us. Okay, so I'm gonna... That was kind of long wordy, so I'm gonna cut out what I talk to this royal servant here. So basically wants us to hand out flyers. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, let me talk to this. Who's the, what does this person do? Seasonal event prizes. Okay, so certificates. Since that request is repeatable, we're gonna have to do these a couple times. What is this? A table? Oh, it's a table. So it's an indoor furnishing. Peach confetti. Do not care about peach confetti. Alright, where do I hand out flyers? Okay, I'm gonna hand out some flyers. Here we go. Hey, here's one. It's an Uldan citizen. Ah, uh, there's the quite so standing at Pink Panther Plaza. Put it in a little bit there. Pew! Is this what I think it is? I went to see the songbirds the other night and I didn't regret a second when that Master Masha started dancing. Even the heavens above. Can I just hand them out in the same area? Here's that. Little ladies day is in full swing. Can we have here? Blah, blah, blah. Have that. Hey man, check this out. You heard of songbirds? Yeah, songbirds. They're epic as balls, yo. Alright, back to report to that royal sentinel. You missed out. I knew the songbirds when they weren't popular. Whatever. Would you like to visit the songbirds? Uh, I mean, yeah, I guess so. Look at him. 
How old did they say they were? Preteen? What? This is the same clothes they've been in. Not when I first started thanks to you, today's show was a success. I never thought I'd be a performer in front of so many people. I'm gonna ever pay you. Oh, I can think of it. Oh, wait. Indeed, it is most com it's almost comical to think of how much success attributes to you. Coming out, blah, 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 blah. More than that, the fans, blah, blah, blah. Performances, blah, blah, blah. They're the best in the world, yeah. Wow, ooh, la, 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 la. You truly think it could happen? I think it can happen. Is she pooping? I think it can happen. I know. It will happen. She's like, ah, it's gonna happen. Bloop. I don't know about that Lala fell. I would have preferred like a Hume girl. Who'd you like to Who'd you like to speak with? Uh, let's, let's talk to the cat girl, Masha. What is this? Why is this like? Be quiet! <laughs> Be quiet! Okay, Star Truck, get out of here! Get out of here! Just watch your Mickey Mouse. Starka! Okay, no more. So what is this? Why? Oh my god. What would you like to ask? I really don't want to ask her anything. What's the point of this? I'm not wearing death ears. Uh, what are your interests? What are your interests? Interests? Oh, there's nothing more I love than dancing. Whether I'm doing it myself or watching someone else, even when I don't realize it, everyone has their own signature moves. And that's what I like best, but there's such a beautiful art. Maybe you've heard about one of the most popular choreographs from the Gold Saucer. We'll be releasing a book of the ballroom eti etiquette series. God, I don't know how I'll pay for that one. Simply must go. Uh, blah, blah, blah. There might be some secrets in here, so I guess I'm going to read this text, but I'll probably skip it. I suppose the only thing... For me, it looks like I'll need to sneak my way into the time of my life event down at the Gold Saucer. If I can perform as well as the last time, I should win enough MGP for both buy the book and have some left to spare. Time of my life event. That sounds fascinating. Okay, so the quest is complete. So I guess... Seasonal event and prizes. So, I don't see... I don't see the... I don't see the uh, the body pieces yet. Oh, wait. There's another quest right here. It just popped up. And I'm stupid. There it is. Okay. So that, the Lord's Sulkin. That should be really cool. The Royal Sentinel is important to discuss with you. Let's accept it. Good evening, adventurer. Your timing couldn't be better. So, uh, so it happens, I have one last favor to ask you. Well, the songbirds have made a name for themselves in the streets of Ulda. I took the yellow people. I fear your our current stage strategy of handling our sweets and flyers may not be enough to propel them forward to their ultimate goal. Indeed, what they need is a leader, someone charismatic who, like glue will hold the group together even through the worst of times. To this end, I've decided to hold a vote on who would who would best represent them as a whole. All votes except yours are in, and it looks to be the to be a close competition. To close too close in fact that your one vote may end up being the one to decide it all. Choose carefully, Kamino, and the songbirds send take our songbirds to new heights. The certificates of collaboration you have received will identify you as one of the contributors. Please hand them to either the, s the slight gentleman over there or the stout fellow beside him. And I will tell them who it is you believe to be the most worthy of being crowned later. While the reward will may remain the same, the outcome of this quest will change based on whether you decide to vote using one or twenty certificates of collaboration. One or twenty? What? Uh, if you would like to vote using a single certificate, speak with the slight servant. If you would like to vote using twenty certificates, speak with the stout servant. What? And 
who is he talking about? Do the repeatable quest 20 times and then go talk to the servant. Why? Put your vote in. Well, I could just end it now and get my stuff and be done. Like, what's, what's the point? I don't know. I don't know yet. What are, where are the servants? The Petal King Zoo. Part of the inventory field door. Oh, there they are. It changes the storyline somehow. Okay, so, uh, I am back. It took me a long time to get all those quests done, but I finally got all 20 of those stupid... Oops, I didn't mean to open the party menu. Got all 20 of those stupid certificates. Uh, literally said that our rewards were exactly the same, but I wanted to show you guys what, I guess, the 20 certificate thing was. Um, anyway, each time you... So I was looking into it, or kind of paying a little more attention to the quest. Each time you complete the repeatable seasonal event quest, you get a chance to talk to the girls, and then you get a chance to talk to them individually and kind of learn more about them. Because I, th I think it's one of them that you pick who to be the leader. I'm assuming it's one of them, which doesn't make any sense because they only give you, like, maybe you can either vote with 20 tickets or vote with one ticket, but you get to vote for one of the three girls. I'm assuming I haven't talked to these guys yet. Um, one thing that's cool is, uh, before I do this, I'll show you this guy right here. Um, like the last year's seasonal event, I can't remember if I did a video for it or not, but, uh, the enamored enthusiast here, he'll actually, um, if you talk to him, he'll show you the different cutscenes, uh, because last year, with last year's event, um, the more the players did the event, it would physically change, like, the stage or whatever that was on display in Ulda, and that's what it did for the girls as well, so... Um, when they were dancing on stage down here, they're out here dancing, they're in certain costumes. Um, that starts out they were dancing and they were in crappy costumes and there was nobody watching them and things like that, but now they're all like, I don't know. I find that, I find that kind of cool and interesting, I think, which is cool about the Little Ladies Day events as well. Um, because it really shows kind of like player, player driven conquest to it um, all right so I'm gonna vote with the stout servant because I slaved through it and got all 20 I see that you only you I see well blah, blah, man I'm so tired from work right now it's hard to read I see that not only have you decided on who you would like to vote for but also whether you should do so with 20 of your certificates of collaboration why won't you be pleased? You may only participate in this vote once. If you would like to cast your vote using a single certificate of collaboration, go speak with the blah, 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 blah. Okay, so we're going to turn these in. A small square slip of parchment stamped with the Ulan Royal Satchel seal, proving, that, proving your aid in the promotion of the songbirds. Okay, hand over. And I'm wondering at the very end of the event. I'm wondering at the very end of the event. Um, if something else will change, or if the, I think this might just be it. And you, and you pick. You may only vote once. Are you sure you would like to proceed with Tony's tickets of collaboration? Yes. Yeah, it makes you vote for one. So yeah. After getting to know them all, like I think it's a hard choice. Ooh la la. Ooh la la is very self-centered, and she has a giant, giant ego, but I think that determination would take the group pretty far. Um, the other two are pretty normal girls. Like, they kind of refuse to join the songbirds at first, um, but are really enjoying it. Um, I don't know. I'm a total cat girl fan, so I think I'm gonna go vote for Masha. Me, the leader? Are you quite sure? I, I hardly dare believe it. I, 
I apologize, I have nothing prepared, and I have never been one for sentimentality or speeches. As that's more ooh la specialty. But as my pumpkin headed, pumpkin headed sister might say, core, this is amazing. Not even my wildest dreams, I thought I'd be acquainted with a leader, much as mean, such an esteemed adventurer as yourself. Thank you, Kamino. So esteemed. Yeah. Yeah, you wanna. Now take us far beyond where the stars reach, where the peaks of the musical heavens lie. <clears throat> I am sorry, I'm not doing well. First of all, I can't do girl voices anyway, but I am just so tired. I got. Yeah. I am. Um, between the two videos, I, I had to go to work, so. It's been a long day. Uh, let's see. I will take us far beyond where the stars reach to where the peaks of the music, musical heavens lie, and you'll once again be hearing the name the Songbirds. The Songbirds. When the day comes, you will be sure to visit us and share the tales of your extraordinary adventures with us, won't you? Even were even were we to conquer all of Eosia with our singing and dancing, it'd be a, it'd be an empty victory if we couldn't share it with you. Aww. That's so nice. Maybe she'll share something else with me. Oh wait, wait, the preteens? Uh, this might be... Alright, back to this guy. With the new leader in place, there is nothing holding the songbirds back from the achieving their goals. As a matter of fact, they're already well on their way. If you haven't heard, the mithril eye contact this is the same <laughs> Oh yeah, I was supposed to be... <laughs> this was... I had a really good voice for him, and I'm just completely forgetting it. Save it. Run the feature article on the girls. With such exposure, it won't be long until they find themselves performing all across Eosia. However, until all that until that great day is upon us, we need to continue forging onward and upward. Thank you again, adventurer, for your better friend. Blah blah blah. The songbirds. Blah. Okay. And there you have it. So let me put this. Uh, That is actually really quite badass looking. It really reminds me of like a like a really like nice martial arts outfit almost. Like you see in like some jelly movies or something. That's really cool looking actually. I was excited kind of when I actually saw them. That's a neat outfit. That's very white mage looking too, that's probably why I like it. Uh, let's see if I unequip everything coming so I kind of see it by itself. Oh yeah, and it even looks cooler now that you can see the sleeves. That's neat. Okay guys, well, thank you so much for watching. Um, hopefully it was enjoyable. Little Ladies Day event was fun. Uh, usually they're longer videos and and kind of drag on too long, uh, but I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and until the next video, be kind to each other, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. Oh shit! What happened to? How did he just die? Oh! Oh! You can fall! I didn't know you could fall!